So here we're going to teach you the five rules of standing on business, stand, right? Don't, well, go ahead. All right. Go ahead, tell us five rules. First rule. You got to stand on shit so you don't get stepped on. You Ooh, feel me? Yeah. I'm adding that. I'm adding you feel me? Like, give, let me give you an example, right? Like, you got a house, right? But the, they got a big house, a mansion, everything. Everything is all good. But the only thing is, there's roaches in there, right? There's roaches in the mansion. Like, all right. You got two choices. You're going to stay in a beautiful house and let this one roach fuck up your whole thing. Or you're going to step on that bitch, all right? Don't let the roach stay. That's all like, all right, that's, that's number one. You gotta, you, uh -huh. you gotta step, step on it. You gotta step on it, all right? Step on business like you step on roaches. Right, because once you get the roaches out, the, the beautiful mansion is gonna, Ooh, you, are you right know what I'm saying? That. It's gonna, there's nothing wrong with it. Mm -hmm. The it's only thing that, that was wrong with it is you didn't step roach. on business in the beginning, right? Ooh, and then there's, now there's more roaches, you feel me? So the roaches standing on business the whole yeah, time? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? You treat can't. Treat yourself like a king. Now that's number two, because if you can't treat yourself like a king, what was I talking about? What's the video about? <laughs> yeah. Number three. All right, what's the next one? What's the next one? All right, if you don't stand on business, business is going to stand on you. And that's what you don't want to happen. All right, that's number three. That's number three. Mm -hmm. Example. <laughs> what? Bad, 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 like bad. for example, how are you gonna let me steal your video? This is your idea. Oh no 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 no! You're you're doing your version of standing on business, and I keep forgetting right. something they're not gonna teach you guys in school. Hoes over bros. Listen, 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 listen closely, all right? Cause the hoes is gonna suck your dick. Your bros is not gonna do that shit. That he did not drop the mic with that one. That's, that's not valid. No, that's not valid. <laughs> First off, those sentences don't even go together. Hoes right. over bros is ridiculous. And bros. for you to for you to be like, oh, I'm staying with the hoes over my bros because she sucked dick. That's gay. <laughs> that's that's what the heck. Like first off, the hoe is supposed to. It's a given that the hoe is supposed to be doing that. Yeah. And it's a given that your bros not supposed to be doing that. So how that sentence work? <laughs> Pick the mic up right back. Right, listen. <laughs> for example, this bitch told me, "Hey, yo." You gay, you always chilling with your bands. What did I do? I went to go with her. That's the first mistake. Don't She's do that. Don't do that. Don't I swear, that. I was about to say, that's a whole red flag, bro. That girl is a gaslighting that, If you let a girl play with you like that, you was weak. Don't do that, all right? <laughs> that was a test. Ooh, you know that was smart. You know what I'm saying? Was, that got me. That See? got me. See? That, that test got me I'm real quick. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. You got to stand on business so business don't stand on you, you feel mm. me? You got to tell that bitch, hey, I'm about to chill with my man. Shut the fuck up so Ooh, she can I, think about you. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling you, it works. I wouldn't I wouldn't curse, but yeah, I would say... What now, you, you got to look at that bitch in the eyes and say, babe, look at me. Shut the fuck up, all right? You tweaking. All right, that's all you got to say. Hey, yo. <laughs> hey, yo. <yeah. laughs> And then she gonna tell her, she gonna tell her friends, I don't know why Ed treats me like this, but she gonna keep on the back. I'm right, that's what I'm saying. I'm what the heck? You. <laughs> she be like, I don't know why he treat me like this, just to be there the next day. Like, what exactly, the heck? Exactly, exactly. All right, now mm. rule number five. What's the? I know, I know. This only came from my head. I can't. Nobody else can tell you this shit. If you didn't, if you didn't get what I was trying to say by rule three. You weren't standing on business. Since the beginning. <laughs> you weren't standing on business. You were never video. standing on business since the beginning. I'm telling you. Use no, lotion. Number, seven. <laughs> number seven. Number seven. Okay, tell me how lotion goes with standing on business. All right. First, first, first impressions is everything, right? Mm -hmm. So if you if you meet a girl for the first time and you ask she, she gonna remember that for the rest of her life. She be like, oh, the first time I met this nigga, he was a little ashy, but he was cool. You know what I'm saying? That's always a little first. ashy, but he was cool. It's ridiculous. <laughs> See, that always comes first, bro. Oh, so she gonna remember your ashy and the first time you cool you use lotion, she, 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 and you smell good. You can't, she can't say nothing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Oh yeah. Smelling good is the first step to having riz. I should do a video on how to how to get your riz game up. I will be teaching you all the art of standing on business because all 2024, I've decided that I wanted to stand on business. And since I'm standing on business, it's only right that my viewers stand on business. So we are on the same page. All right. So I wrote down this list of five steps. No, five rules on how to stand on business and so not steps. And the difference between steps and rules is steps is anybody can take these steps to stand on business. But rules are if you live it, and do it every day, it eventually becomes a part of you. So you can't just take steps to stand on business. You can't stand on business one day out of the week. That's ridiculous. That's crazy. No, you have to make sure you stand on business at all times. So starting in 2024, I'm gonna be standing on business from now to the day I die, inshallah. All right, 
So rule number one of standing on business is self-love. Because if you don't love yourself, there is nobody in this world that can love you more than yourself. So what I like to do about self-love self -love really is, I like to just think about the things that I want to do, the things that make me happy, hobbies, little things, you know, what make me happy. See, and then I like to differentiate that from things that make me happy, but involves other people. So like say, for example, say I like to hoop, but I only like hooping when other people are around. That's not standing on business. That's not staying on business at all. Say I love hooping, but I hoop by myself, regardless of who's there, whatever time it is, that's standing on business, and that's self-love. So, rule number one, self-love. Rule number two is self-confidence, or just confidence. So basically, with confidence, it's, it's difficult because at the end of the day, you being confident has to be like a mental, physical, spiritual thing. Meaning you have to be confident in everything you do. Every step you take, you cannot hesitate because remember, a moment of hesitation is a moment that can change a whole lifetime. So what I like to do about being confident is I like to do things that I hate doing. So for me, for example, I am not photogenic and I hate cameras. But look at me, I'm making a YouTube channel. You know what that means? I'm standing on business. Thank you very much. That's rule number two, self-confidence. Rule number three of standing on business is obviously standing on business. Some people may say that you can't use a word to define itself, but I'm saying standing on business is it's one in itself. When you stand on business, you're standing on business. There is no in-betweens. There is no compromise. There is no, well, I mean, there is compromise if it comes to it, but that's, you still have to stand on business when it comes to that. But yeah, rule number three, stand on business. To stand on business, you have to stand on business because like a wise man once said, if you're not standing on business, business is standing on you. All right, so rule number four is be yourself. Being yourself, some people may find it hard to be yourself because everybody is their own person. But at the end of the day, what it means to be yourself is to go out there and just like, say for example, you're in a group but the group acts one way, but your body tells you, yo, I don't want to act this way, but the only reason I act this way is because of the group. You're not standing on business. So you have to be yourself. If you're going to be a part of that group, at least be yourself while you're a part of that group because at the end of the day, when that group is gone, you're not them and they are not you. You have to be yourself. That's rule number four. Rule number five, this is a very, very important rule. Rule number five of standing on business is there is no rule number five, because at rule number three, you should have been standing on business. Standing on business is something you have to do. It's not an immediate change, but it's more like a, a gradual change if you're, willing, if you're willing to actually learn like, how to stand on business. But apart from that, those are the five rules of standing on business. And if anybody needs help, well, you guys can ask me. My name is Dr. Finesse or some call me the professor, but like I'm saying, like if you need any tips and tricks on how to stand on business, let me know. But all 2024, we are standing on business. Me and my group, you guys are my group. So we are standing on business. Whenever we feel some sort of way, whenever we feel like justice is not being served, you know what we're gonna do all 2024? We're gonna stand on business. That's what we're gonna do. Thank you very much. So thank you all for- Huh? Yeah, what AZ the problem child said. Yo, I want to take the same. <laughs> yeah. Stand on business. You gotta get about your fitness. Whole time, my boy said stay, but I left for the bitches. Oh my god. <laughs>